Hi right, guys, Joe here from Bobtown Vlogs, and I'll shortly be leaving uh, for Bob's latest game away at Wisbeach in the wake of the ground being uh, flooded yesterday. Uh, quite seriously, the pitch was about three feet of water, you could probably swim in it. And uh, it's very sad, obviously, all the. Uh, can't, we can't retrieve the kits, I think we'll borrow a Michelover's kit today. And also the uh, the infrastructure and stuff that have recently been put in uh, now going to have to be rebuilt. So uh, that that's very sad. If there's just giving paid on Belper social media, if you want to contribute to that, then I'm sure they'd welcome it. And uh, yeah, so that'll obviously be the backdrop of today's game, which is a shame, but it'll be on the pitch. You no, know, Wisbeach was a tough place to play. We went there last year, grinded out a win. They've had a, got a new manager this season, a lot of new players. I don't think it's quite clicking yet from, uh, from what I've been told, but... Uh, I think it will do soon for them, so it's going to be a tough game, especially with the uh, what we've had going on. Uh, what we've had going on with the floods and stuff. We uh, played quite well on Tuesday night. Uh, to be fair, against Buxton Day, I think I think they're a weekend side out, but to beat team in the league above, it's, it's easily done. And if we can pick up three points today, I think that will be the uh, the perfect response to uh, what happened yesterday. So yeah, drop a like if you enjoy it. Subscribe if you're new. As I say, if you want to contribute, just go and page on Belper social media then. By all means do. So uh, I'll see you in my speech. <laughs>
something's right now. Where's my trick now? And if you chuck a brick and sit there to the left, you'll let it to the right. And when we went promotion, we'll sing this song all night. He wears magic hat And if you chuck a brick and it's too right Brace for you today and a, and a good win for the side. So pretty good day for you. Yeah, great day. Um, we had to put what uh, we had to put Newcastle right. We felt we, should, we let ourselves down that game, so we had to put um, to put that right today. I think we played well first half. Maybe let ourselves down second half, but to come to a place like this and um, to come away with three points is you can't ask for much more than that. So yeah, uh, your goals uh, was about being in the right place at the right time. Is that something you work on a lot? Or? Yeah, well. As you'll know, I've been here two years now and I've scored many, as many goals as I probably should have, but it's um, starting to come together now, so hopefully it'll be a, a sign of things to come. Yeah, any teammates today that impressed you in particular, or was it just a group effort? Um, it's a group effort. We've got a few lads playing with knocks and injuries, and you've always got to be impressed when they're willing to play with injuries. Um, lads have been out of the team and come back in, and they look like they've never left. So, well, as much as it's um, some good individual performance, it's always about being a team and, and, and playing well as a team. Yeah, look at that, got a tough run of fixtures coming up, so how important is today's win in terms of momentum going forward? Of course it's been, we've got to keep it, we've got to keep it like the train rolling, but you say the big games, we feel we can beat any team. Um, we're going to, we're going to games full of confidence, we've not been beating the league yet. Um, I think there's only been a couple of bad performances this season, so if we get the lads fit, keep them together, keep them strong, then I don't see why um, we can't continue the run. Well done, well done, thank you. Thank you very much.